Hey everyone and welcome back to Tuesday's reading. This is Anna. This is a reading for Tuesday, November the 19th. All right, quick shuffle, continuing with the, the Sacred Rose Tarot. So shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. And we're pulling the Six of Cups. I'll show that to you up close in a second. And we're pulling the Four of Cups. I'm going to go ahead and shuffle the Oracle here. And... Looking at the oracle, the map maker of destiny, and I'll show that to you up close in a second as well. Okay, and um, we're just gonna, I'm gonna put it over here actually for now. Okay, so um, six of cups and four of cups, 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 emotions, emotions, heart. Um, we're thinking, uh, not thinking. We are, we're having feelings on this day that. Um, um, we're, we're having to think back to a time when, when things were really good. The Six of Cups is a, a, typically the card of nostalgia, of thinking of the happier times, you know, when things were so wonderful and beautiful in your life. But then we have the Four of Cups, okay? And this Four of Cups um, is a card where... Uh, it's like you're unable to see the opportunity in front of you. Um, interestingly, how these these four cups are stuck. They, these look like uh, walls of, of like two rocks, right? So it's like being stuck between the hard place and a rock. So that's a you're stuck between a hard place and a rock. You're not sure where you're gonna go to with whatever's going on in your emotional world. Okay, um, four is a number of stability but it's also a number associated in numerology with hang up so if you are feeling like you're stuck in this hard place between the you know the rock and the hard place you know um it's probably because you're having some sort of hang up hang ups because you're relying too much on the things that were in the past and that they're not any longer okay in the past perhaps six um it's a number where, um, associated with uh moving pieces lots of people that kind of thing interconnectedness interestingly enough yesterday we pulled the six of coins and now we have the six of cups huh six six um Anyhow, so the, these are the hang-ups that um, you're going to have to get over. It's a hurdle you need to get over, okay? Because the divine is saying, I'm handing you something. You see this hand on this cup? There's something there's, that I'm handing you, but you're unable to see it because you're focusing too much on all this other, all this other emotional baggage, okay? The Oracle card is the map maker of destiny. This is a, it reads authentic purpose, inspiration, and free will. But really when you look in this, when you're looking at this image, the, the message is simple. I mean, this is about um, taking your fate, okay, and and you're changing it into your destiny. So whatever life has handed you, literally whatever has been handed to you, um, there is something positive that you're able to turn it into. You just need to open your mind, open your eyes, and open your heart, open your heart chakra, so that you're able to feel the thing that is present in your life, um, that you are able to really really make something of it okay so get over the past hang-ups okay get over all these past hang-ups okay and you're able to to make a, a something of your fate a, you know you you are defining your destiny the map maker of destiny okay you have a wonderful day hope this reading reaches you love and plenty of abundance always and i will see you tomorrow okay bye bye